All right, I wanted to show you... I wanted to show you really quick in this random battle that I'm doing. Uh, I'm doing this off camera, but I wanted to show you the disability parlay, because I probably don't get too many chances to show it off. So this enemy is down to critical health, so he's basically one hit away from being defeated. Um, and he has to be in this critical mode, and I can use parlay as a paladin on him to convince him to leave the battle. So, 88% chance. Let's see what it looks like. And there we go. He uh, left the field of combat, and now he can also not be revived uh, uh, after if he got normally if he got knocked down, if a uh, mage or someone uses a phoenix down item, you know he could be brought back. But this time, he's removed from combat and cannot come back. Welcome back to Final Fantasy Tactics Advance on the Game Boy Advance. I'm going to start a new mission. We have lots of missions to choose from. Uh, there were more, but uh, maybe it depends on if I'm in Sprom or not, or what, what day it is, what day in the year. Your life or death, a student needs some homework. So we will take that one. Neville can take that. So that'll take one battle to complete. Neville is back because he just got pardoned after spending some time in jail. So now he's got a clean record. It says he has zero yellow or red cards. So Alchemist wants to live alone. Ten days dispatch mission. Um, we'll send uh, Schutmeyer on that. I think I'm being watched. I've heard flapping wings at night. Please investigate. I'll send that one later. Your white flowers. Please bring me some of the flowers I planted on the Giza plains. They're the only way to cheer my sister up since mom died. That's pretty harsh. So we'll we'll go to the white flowers and we'll take our sprinkler and get egg soup. And lions. This is a great piece of uh, music, by the way. Let's see how we're gonna strategize this. I might yank a, a thief to learn counter, and I might make him a paladin again after that, because that it is a tank class. Uh, I just don't know how I feel about a cl the, the class in general. I wonder where Tamil planted those flowers. Defeat all enemies, we can do that. There are only a couple. Hopefully, we are over-leveled. Uh, let's see. We can do double shot now as well. Consecutive damage. So it's not super high damage, but we have two chances to hit. Or miss, I guess. Okay, and what... One thing we want to do... Just having ranged attacks always good, and here very high dam. Airbender is so good; it's so high damage. If it lands, it it seems to. So even when it says seventy five percent chance to hit, it feels like it misses more often. Okay, Marsh is also going this direction. He Marsh has high damage even as a thief. Yank here. Twenty nine damage versus. Oh, still, that's 29. Still, I mean, uh, air render. 60. Oh, huge. I don't even know what that's tied to. Like, if your regular weapon damage only causes you to do 29 damage, but your air render damage is double that. Like, what, what stats does it base that off of? Maybe that's on the wiki somewhere, but I can't even, can't even think of it. Critical hit, but no, not a lot of damage. Yeah, we are overleveled, so we're doing pretty good. Maybe air render isn't, um, like the enemy's defense doesn't calculate towards it, or not as much. Magic hammer, so that's, I think that just hurts my uh, MP, which as Marsh, yeah, as you can see there, MP 2 out of 33. But it doesn't bother us because Marsh, uh, he has he has spells, they just, they're just terrible. 
I think we want to uh, cast haste on him. His speed is still not very good. Like last episode we found out that um, even as a thief it seems like Marsha's speed is really low. And it's not helping him. But I think we'll be okay, especially if we level as a faster class, like a thief or a ninja. Uh, I think we can make up for that a little bit. And I think we should give up on the idea of having him be good at magic. I don't think that's gonna work out very well. Maybe a late game thing, just to have him experience more classes and more types of abilities. But you can only have two sets of abilities anyways, and like the fighter set is extremely good. And I want to have thief abilities. Maybe the ninja ones to inflict status effects. So other than that, I can't really uh can't really think of what I would want to do with him. So let's get her close here and try to get a hit in. Yes. You can see we can only get one XP, so that's that means we're too high level to get any sort of meaningful XP from these guys. Okay, now this has a chance of an instant KO. Almost, almost, very close. So, Because there's about a 10% variation in uh, how much damage it can do. I'll just attack him in the back there. That'll be fine. And I'm excited for at least our uh, one of our, our, our uh, Neville, I should say, to be back. Actually, ice. We wanted to cast ice because it's at least one dispatch mission down. Neville is still learning uh, more Beastmaster skills. And again, right now they're not coming in handy, but they will. Oh, of course, we want, we would like Marsh to learn blue magic. Uh, maybe Yenke as well. That would be good because only mm, uh, humans can learn blue magic skills. It's an instant KO. That could be an instant KO. Let's try it. Let's risk it. Yes, very good. And blue magic skills are just... They're not always that good, but they are interesting. Some of them can be good. Let's see. And I had to uh, spend most of my gold, by the way. So that's also why I want to keep doing some more quests. I had to spend almost all of my gold to get some new equipment. And make sure that our our clan keeps learning new abilities because I, I kind of want to ensure that they're constantly learning something new improving their skill set I feel like that's the best use of my time and then best use of the the, the in-game gold because otherwise I can't really think of what you would want to use the gold for if not to spend it here they are let's get these back home So we found the white flowers and we completed this mission. And this is just a side mission. The uh, next main quest is uh, pretty important, but I want to make sure I'm ready for that. Mastered counter, very good. Life or death is back. Yep, the Gale Sword, Black Thread, skill level up. Okay, how... where are you gonna go? So we, we kind of don't want uh, to be interrupted while we're heading back to town. Okay, good. There was a new rumor about crazy monsters, by the way. Uh, experts believe it has something to do with the crystals. Pure magic in a solid form are supposed to be somewhere in this kingdom. Rumors say the palace made the crystals. Rumors the palace firmly denies. I think we'll find out more about that. Earthy colors. I restore artwork for a living, but I'm out of paints. I need some rock from the mountains. Only the hardy need apply. If 
Five days, we don't need anything. We get ancient text for it. I think we'll take that. Who wants some free... Neville, you can do it again. You're hardy, I guess. That'll be fine. And then Lucia Pass. I opened... This is like a freeing, freeing up mission because of the little flag. I opened a shop in Lucia Pass, but not a single customer has come yet. I think I need to advertise. Could you pass out flyers? Oh, that's a dispatch mission. Three enemies. Um, I think I want to wait. Yes, and Twisted Flow I want to wait on as well. So I think I'm going to... Waste some time walking around until my dispatch people come back. Mad Alchemist is back. Skill level up. And then I think now the other one will be back. Okay, very good. New units trying to seek membership. A level 12 Moogle Black Mage. So you're not special. You're not special. Um, but you are a Moogle. I could use another Moogle character. I'll take it. I'll take him. You can get rid of clan members later. I, I would feel bad to do it, but... Number 8. Why do I have you guys sorted like that? Here, like that. Okay, what? I don't have equipment for you. I barely have anything for you. So you're a black mage. You don't... You have good magic power. I think that would change if I changed your class. I made you an animist. Would that change? No, you're definitely like the magic type. Uh, I think we can work with that. We'll give you a rope and a rod. Uh, and that's it for right now. We'll train him off camera probably a little bit. I think we can work with that. Okay, see if there's other missions. Newbie Hall. Part-time teachers need it. Help apprentices in a wide variety of jobs learn the tricks of your trade. 10 days. Onion sword. That's a unique sword, I think. Combat level 5. And I don't have that. That's a clan skill that I need. Okay, so Lucia pass. We can send someone out. Who can... Who wants to pass? Yes, you can pass out flyers, can't you? Yes. You would be great at doing that. Well, and I guess then we're gonna go do Twisted Flow. Uh, here. I've seen the Yulai River bending and warping most strangely, but no one else can see anything. Please find out the truth. Jura, Time Mage Adept. No cancellations. Okay, we've got some more uh, items to bring with us. Mithril Pick. It says Attack Up. White Flowers. Enhances Holy Power. That would be like uh, uh, healing magic. Black magic to enhance power. Magic power up. Ancient text. Defense. I don't know what that means to O. Oh, I don't know if that's good. It's like to get egg soup. It's like defense and resistance. Like, is that good? Uh, white flowers for the holy power. Mithril pick. Attack up. We'll do attack up. That'll be good. Okay, and then we'll go check it out. So let's see if uh, what happens if we visit the river. We haven't been to the river at all yet, because that's a completely new area, so I am excited. Okay, I don't want to fight these guys. They will probably walk to in this direction. No, they won't. Okay. See, now it becomes more of a... You can see it can become a little bit difficult to move around. No, I, want, I don't want knives to be forbidden. Fire, forbidden, ice, recommended. That's good, we can do with that. Alright, let's see what happens. Looks like a normal river to me. I don't see any warping or bending at all. Huh? What? Funny, I had a strange feeling there. 
Oh no, what's that? Whoa, what was that? River, what's going on? So now we're gonna get our first encounter with one of the crystals. You know, that they mentioned literally last episode, last mission. What was that? That black thing in the river swallowed me and... What is this place? Am I still in Ivalice? Some kind of ruins? Wait. Is this a crystal? A wrinkle in space. So the crystal's magic was making the river bent. The rumors were true, the warping was a way in. I have to find out what this crystal really is. But before that, I should find a way out. Speak your name, you who profane the light. Who's there? Zoom. That's a uh, Femfrit, I think, is his name. I ask again, speak your name, you who profane the light. I... My name is Marsh. Who the heck are you? I'm the Totem of Femfrit. Femfrit, I don't know. What's up, fam? I'm wielder of the power, I am the protector. Totem protector? He thinks I'm after the crystal. You are an intruder. Well, I didn't have a choice in coming here. Look, I don't know anything about your crystal. I am under orders to expel all intruders. Wait, I'm telling you, I came in here by accident. I don't think he's, uh, he cares too much. He summoned some uh, eyeballs. And a red judge, look at that. There's the judge, just like a normal engagement. Well, no point worrying whether I can win or not. I just have to try. But we're not alone. We have our clan with us. So here's a, a red judge. Very interesting. A crystal doesn't have anything. Famfrit. Ex Totema. Let's see what that says. Powerful guardians of the crystals. It is unknown which master they serve, if any. Expulse. Totema commands drive off all intruders. Mage storm. Totem of command, use all the world's magic. Counter weapon attack plus. Improves weapon attacks to deal more damage. So even though he already has a really high weapon attack, uh, weapon attack plus makes it even better. And we can actually look at his abilities. Breath of God. Envelops surrounding units and deals damage. Light speed. Lightning fast attack. Nullifies reaction abilities. Presence. Fair of God damages and knocks back target. And he can do Demi. Half of target's HP gone. Slow. Metals with time slow reducing target's speed. That's uh, really scary. So he's truly a boss fight. And then we just have these little dudes. Float eyes. Devil gaze. Gazes, gaze silences and inflicts darkness. And weapon defense plus. And what do you have? An RM1. Powerful float eye. Its evil gaze deals damage. Roulette. Decides who is KO'd friend or foe. So a random person gets KO'd if that hits someone. Circle. Oh, I wanted to uh, investigate that. Circle. Mystical circle lowers weapon attack and magic power. So they're not making it easy on us. Okay, Mont Blanc for some magic. Okay, shoot my Mariette Domi. And then the only person I don't have in here is Neville. Which I think Like I'm having to think, like we and we enhanced holy power. So do you wanna take someone out? Do you wanna take Yank out? In favor of Neville. Let's do that. Let's see if uh let's just let's just pray that this works. Defeat the boss, so we do not need to defeat the Aramans. 
But because they're not very high level, we probably could. Okay, fight. 52 damage. And if we try double shot? 26 damage. But we have we have a better chance to at least hit one of the attacks. There we go, we hit both. You can see we are over leveled. And he will counterattack us, but we defeat him. Remember, fire was forbidden. Now we shouldn't uh, be, we have to worry about that. We shouldn't have to worry about that at all. Because I don't think we have much in terms of fire damage. If, as long as we don't pick it in color magic, then we will, uh, we'll be okay. So he's going to cast Circle to weaken attacks and magic. And it misses, so... Okay. You're going to just attack, probably, but we have counterattacks. Of course, if they miss, then that's not exactly what we want. Um, how much damage would we do? 56. But we can also go behind you. 52, so we would probably get this guy in one hit. And we can get this guy in one hit. There we go, we'll just try that. And he's down. Make sure we face Famfrit, because he's probably very, very tough. Uh, we can cast Shell. Now let's hit the most people. Like, do this right here. Magic resistance up. I don't know if he's going to try anything, but... Okay, Marsh. Let's just see uh, if you can hit Famfrit. He doesn't have that much health. 45 damage. He will counter. Um, instead of attacking him, can attack uh, this guy, knock him out. So we made short work of the armaments. There's one float eye over there still. I'm not too worried. Okay, he's going to do a little damage and Domi's going to counter-attack. Please hit, please hit. Wow. So now it's just us and Famfrit. Famfrit is the slowest, but he also hits the hardest. We can move up. What, what kind of black magic damage would we do on him? Not a lot. Not a lot at all. So, uh... Oh, Reflect. I just started learning Reflect. Reflect, white, red, time, and black magic. Okay, that's a single single unit cast, so let's put it on Martian. And I don't know if it's going to help. I don't know if some of his spells count as spells. So we'll see. We'll see what, what's going to happen. He's going to attack, do a distant attack. Just damage? That's Breath of God, isn't it? Yes, it's a AoE ranged attack. And it does a lot of damage. But you're within range for Schutmeyer's counterattack because he has a two space attack range with his uh, lance, his spear. Sharpshoot. Uh, toxic. Maybe we can uh, poison him. Yes, he, we do decent damage on him, so we, we should not have to worry too much at all. We have this in the bag. He's gonna counter hit on that, so can we step on to the side? Or can we just attack from where we're standing? Yeah, we have a good uh, enough... Okay, I was gonna say 70% I would normally say is, is good enough for a hit rate. Okay, we'll do uh, air render. Oh yeah, he's almost down already. So this is an easy boss fight. I don't know why I was so worried about it. It's because he hits hard. 
Uh, we boosted Holy, so this should be a fairly good heal. But Neville's the only one that really needs it. Oh, it reflects back on him. So he gets double heal. That is actually very funny. So you could do that on enemies as well. You could cast Reflect on an enemy and have, uh, if they have a white mage, have their own attempts at healing, uh, healing them backfire. Almost down. I'm fine with that. Move in one of the bodies. Time magic. Haste. Who's a low level? We'll just cast haste on Shootmire, that'll be fine. We just... We want him to do something. 12 XP. Well, and we can finish him off. Do it. Very good. We didn't use a combo, but uh, that'll come later. I do want to show you some combos, especially where we have other characters all joining in. I did it! I beat him! Okay, on to the next cutscene here. What is this crystal? Tell me. Why go to such lengths to protect it? The crystal is the thread that binds our world, the world I was born to protect. With the white ones I was born. The white ones? Skilled machinists, they are the source of my power. You mean Moogles? If they wish it, I will lend you my power. Mute? Is that you? When the thread dissolves, so will this world, and another world will be revealed. Who's there? What do you mean, another world? You mean the real world? World? That's a difficult word for me, somehow. So we destroyed one of the crystals that binds the world, and as Famfrit said, he was born with the Mughals. Every crystal also has a race tied to it, one of the races of this world. What's wrong, Mute? Why? Your room's a mess. Look, this is uh, Mute and his dad. <laughs> Papa. Babus came running into my room. He seemed quite flustered. Babus. Babus, Babus. I call him Babus, I don't... You have to learn how to pronounce these things by reading, I guess. Did something happen? I just remembered something horrible. All the kids at school were throwing snowballs at me. And one of the snowballs had a rock inside it. School? What are you talking about, Mute? That, that's right, I'm royalty, I'm a prince. Everyone listens to whatever I say. My word is law. This is my country, nobody picks on me. Mama. In the real world, his mother is uh, dead, uh, or she left him. I think, oh no, she's died. She died. She is uh, dead in the real world. Thank you, Babis. You may leave now. Certainly, sire. So he's a new Mo, but he is unique. It's okay, Mute. You don't have to be scared anymore. To our people, I am Queen Remedy. But always remember, to you, I am your mother, and I love you very much. Isn't this kind of sad? Your papa is the highest judge in the land. That means that all the judges will protect you. Then I want to make the law stronger. Please, can I? Of course you can. You know we'd do anything for you. Your Highness, it might not be wise to sow lightly. One of the crystals has been destroyed. What? Are you certain? I see. There will surely be no complaints about stronger laws then. I'll leave it in your hands, Judge Sid. 
as you wish. Of course, there's always a Sid in every Final Fantasy game. So Mute's royalty. Destroying the crystals will destroy this world while he's happy and he's royalty and he has his family. And bring us back to a real world, world where he doesn't have any of that. Well, I seem to have made it back in one piece. But then again, we didn't choose to go to the crystal and we didn't choose to fight it. He said that the crystal was a threat, that if the threat dissolved, a new world would appear. But this world is still here. Destroying one of the crystals must not be enough. If I destroy them all, will I be able to go back home? This could be my only chance. I have to find the other crystals. Remogle battle commands Totema. So we cleared it. Shoot my master war cry. Bomb. Beat down. Clan level went up. Skill level up. So the little sword uh, at the bottom left there for our clan skills, that's our combat skill. That, that one uh, one mission required. Okay, we've unlocked the new city of Kadoan. And we're gonna place it right here. Ah, you passed out flyers, very good. And he's also now halfway towards learning some of his black mage abilities. Not bad. New unit seeks membership. Teresia. Fencer, you have no abilities. Uh, mm, no, I have enough for right now. Our clan is very exclusive. Okay, so now there is... Here, there's uh, a treasure hunt now over at Lucia. So let's head in that direction. And Kadoan is an interesting new city. I think it's the city of the new Mo. We might get a cutscene as soon as we hit town. But you also will notice that the laws are stronger. So now there's two laws in effect at one time that we have to worry about. Okay, no, no cutscene right there just yet. Treasure hunt. Let's see, what do we get? The rubber suit. It sounds like that would absorb... Uh, electricity. Women's insulated clothing. Nullifies lightning, yes. Uh, because it's women's, it's it only works on Viera. You have a survival vest. What if you, could you wear that? Is it good for you? Defense down, resistance up. By six points. So I guess think we can do that. And then... You don't take damage from lightning, so we could have you charge some lightning monster or whatever if you want. Very good. Let's change up our equipment as well. Okay, that's all I can change for right now. Let's visit Kadoan. We'll get a cutscene right there. I love this. I love this. It look, kind of reminds me of Undead Berg from Dark Souls. Maybe that's just a color palette. Um... But I do like the uh, design. So they're, they're, the cities are also different. I can't believe they strengthened the laws again. Well, let's just eavesdrop on these guys. What's new? The palace is always doing that. I swear the queen takes pleasure in watching us squirm. Hey, hey, watch what you're saying. You never know who might be listening. Oh, um, this is one of my favorite characters right here. The new laws bothering you too, eh? Ha, huh, pretty soon laws will be nothing but a bad memory. How can you be so sure? I thought laws were everything in Ivalice. True, but there's a way around everything, my boy. Hey, have you heard that rumor? You mean about Easel Burbier and his anti-laws? It's hard to believe that anyone could nullify a law. Yeah, but if you could, just imagine. Nullify a law? Precisely. And Easel Burbier figured out how to do it? He certainly did, but if you want to meet him, forget it. He's a busy man with many admirers, shall we say. You seem to know a lot about him. 
Fame has always fascinated me, you see. Ah, sorry, have to run. I have an appointment to keep. Empty loss. I'd sure like to meet that easel guy. Might be easier to do than you think, Marsh. So Easel invented anti-laws and as we'll find out, they are actually able to cancel out a law in turn to tide in our advantage, but that's for later. Let's check out the pub. The crystals. Bravinia Palace, silent on the matter up until now, has radically reversed its policy concerning the crystals. According to information just released, crystals exist in special folds in space called seams. The report goes on to state that, as the crystal's magic is beneficial to all Ivalice, special means are being employed to protect them. And here strong laws. Laws get tougher. By the order of Queen Remedy, laws are getting tougher once again. Protest movements have already started in some clans. The reason given for this latest strengthening of the laws is to maintain public order. This is likely a reaction to the recent surge in clan warring. We have nothing to do with that, do we? The totem on. The totem has appearance in Ivalice was sudden, and their origin unknown. Unfathomable, too, is their incredible power. One thing we can say is, they seem willing to lend that power to us. It is possible to summon the totem using judge points. 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 Bleh, bleh, bleh. Judge points. Obtained by defeating an enemy in an engagement. Only members of the race that a totem represents may summon that totem. In other words, you'd get further talking to a rock than trying to summon another race's totem. So now, our new Moogle friend, as well as um, Mont Blanc, can summon the totem. I think it costs, it costs 10 judge points, and it's an incredible attack. I'll show it very, very soon. Um, before uh, we do, though, let's let's take on some some dispatch missions, and then I'll show uh, I'll show the ability next episode, most likely. They can be watched. That was one nasty doll. That must be the cause of my lady's illness. It must be a voodoo doll. Yeah, we can take to so just send someone out on that. Nume, you go do that. Frozen spring. Someone's frozen. Our village is only spring, and it's not thawing. Our children are thirsty. Twenty days, but we get a dragon bone from that. That sounds cool. Uh, Domi, you go do that. We'll just take on any any timed mission and then... Uh, two battles. Loaded dice, that sounds good. You immortal. Looking for someone to model for a statue to be put in the Royal Library's new wing. Youth, Beauty and Physique a plus. 30 days. We need a Tonberry Lamp. Crafting level 10. That's insane. Oh, Melise. 15 days. We can do that one. Know you, Melise of the Gefius acting troupe. I'm her biggest fan. Won't you give her this song I've written by Valerio? I'm sure, Yankee could sneak in close. There we go. And down to earth. 15 days. 5 days, sorry. I have the incredible power to make things float just by looking at them. Problem is, I can't make them stop floating. Please help. Talk off, psychic. Crystal is what we would get. So, Neville, you have a talent for magic, so maybe you could help him out. And then, Goblin Town here. Goblin stole my favorite monster guide and buried it under rock. I'll give you a copy if you get mine back for me. One battle. Uses up a mithril pickaxe. Uh, which we have. We used it last time, so... For, and we get the monster guide. So we can send someone out to do that. Shootmire, you're strong, you can do that. So instead of timed one, we'll, we'll wait out our timed ones and then... Uh, and we should be fine. Need a white mage for this one. All good. I'll start taking care of that. And uh, this is gone. This episode is is turning out to be quite long, so I will uh, do that some of that off camera, and then I'll see you next time and catch you up on 
anything new, but I won't do anything exciting while you're away, don't you worry. I'll see you later.